Hey, what's up, guys? How is it going? Welcome back to another video. And if you're new to this channel, can you smash and subscribe and turn on the bell icon so anytime I upload a new video, you guys are notified. So, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to create Fiverr gig image from scratch using the Canva free plan. And of course, you can actually use this method to create any kind of Fiverr gig image for your own personal gig. So I'll be showing you um, different um, kind of Fiverr gig image here on Fiverr platform and then we'll choose one that we'll be able to, uh, to design on the Canva free platform. So as you can see here, there are lots of Fiverr gig image on Fiverr on its own and this basically depends on the niche as well so i guess we can literally do something like this or this or this or this so i can do anything you like so i'll just decide to basically go with this or this so let's head up to canva and see what we got there then we'll be able to look into the one we would like to choose and design something like that so um heading up to canva so this is canva platform so the next thing for us to do is just to choose the uh create design then scroll down to custom design so i guess five i just changed the uh, gig image size but i think it's around 720 over 430 i guess so so then i'll click on enter here then it will bring out uh the free or empty design size then i'll just proceed from there to design what i actually want so yeah is the free design skip top so they also bring some free design which i can just choose from but that is not what i actually want to do so the next thing for me is to just look at the design i want to make so i'll just choose from it so for instance let's check around to see if you can find this kind of background on uh canva then we able to um choose so um let's see I'm trying to get this kind of color and then um okay so let's try to find an empty empty background to use then we can proceed for, to our design so i'm trying to look at some free empty or something like i can just use the background then remove all the text on it i actually want to make use of a simple background which we can actually we can change the, the background so i'm looking for something nice that we can just make sure it looks good, so great for our thumbnail uh for gig image to be precise but without wasting much of the time i'll just decide to just go with anyone that i like so if that would be a big case so um well, i can just design something of eggs or maybe I'm trying to just make sure I want to do something great so that you'll be able to do something nice for yourself too when you are trying to make some design. So um, that's why I actually want to make this one amazing and of course what you definitely like. So um, let me just choose a simple design Let me try it just its design so so uh, i just click on L element here then i'll choose this uh rectangle then large this and this 
to fit in the the whole screen of the size that we choose so yeah this is the size so i can just choose the color here then try to try to choose any color that i want so let me just choose this one okay so um let me just choose this one then finding image to use um okay let me try to find image here headshots let me try to find headshots oops I'm trying to find some headshots that I can use on this design and of course you can also import headshots from other platforms maybe um, on splash or from your PC as well so it just depends on where you have your own headshots or the image you want to implement on this design so then just move it up to the to any section you want to put it on the design so but if I don't want to use anyone from Canva on its own, so I'll just add up to um, maybe on splash on splash.com. Then look around if I can find uh headshots that I can use. So headshots. Okay, I think this is nice. Let me. I think I can move this. Okay, let me move this. Then I have to remove BG. To re I want to remove the background of the picture. So move BG. Then let me try to uh, move it up. I can also download it, but I prefer to move it to the design here. So only jpg and png image are supported oops so um i think um on splash just change the image uh this thing so the next thing is just let me try on pixel pixel.com pixels i think it's pixels just let's see Oops, it's not the website I'm going to pick those. Oops, pick those. Oops, I think I, I was gonna make instead of a, a, a make S, so add shot. So yeah, we go. So you can see we have different kind of headshots here too. So let's look around for the best one to use. So um, still checking. Still checking for great headshots. Um. Okay. Wow. I can't find the one I actually like. I won't see the one I actually like. I won't see the one I actually like. Um, portrait. Let me check on portrait too. Wow. Why is it that hard to find a perfect one to use? I think let me let me try this. Let me try this. Okay, so um let's see. Okay, we have the background removed already. So I download the the PNG then 
end up to come by again, then move it up here. So let's wait while it uploads. Then I will flip it up to the to the left side. Um, okay. Think position. Um, okay. No position. Okay, I think it's flip here. Okay, flip. Okay, yeah, we go. So this is what we actually want. So then large this. Scroll down, then large it again to fit in the screen or where we actually want it to be to be placed. So here we go. So let's check on the samples. So yeah. So the test the the icon. Okay, so icon um element. So let's start for Instagram. Instagram. Okay, so we have different IG icon. So you can just proceed on anyone you like. So let's try this and then reduce the size. So then, then the next thing is just the taste, I guess. Okay, Instagram hashtag growth strategy. So click on test. So then, which is some add headline. So let's put in instagram so we have the instagram already if you are cool with the text it's nice but if you are not cool with the uh, font so you can change the font here so we have a lot of fonts of, of fonts here free and the pro one as well so you can choose any one you like so this is the Free one, so then the next thing is thing hashtags. So, hashtag then good strategy. So, you can copy this one since we are using this uh, the test and the font hashtag hashtag. Sorry, hashtag okay, hashtag then. Growth strategy. Growth strategy. Okay, here we go. So you can just reduce the size to be under the hashtag. So we have to place a color under the hashtag as well. Then make it white color. Okay. So choose color here. Yeah. Then. Then put a triangle under underneath or rectangle, sorry. So large it, then move it down to under the hashtag, then large it to fit in the section. Okay, here we go. Then we we'll do this from 32 to let's try 15. Oh, that's too small. Let's try 20. Okay, I think 20 should be nice. So let's move it down here. Okay, so here we go. And this is, as you can see, here, this is Instagram hashtag growth strategy. So let's check on the color. Because I literally don't like how the colors look like, so let's try to change that. So um, the issue is just about the background we use for the design. So then, yeah. So let's try to look for some other color that might be really nice. It is related to the clothes that 
okay i guess this 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 nice is nice this is nice let's let's use this this is nice so um probably you can change this so instagram color on its own or you can also download uh instagram logo or icon from google so make sure we have the best one instagram logo icon icon png so here we go so we can choose this and choose this let's check on the one we have here okay i guess this is the one we have let's check on this this is not a png okay this is png okay let's copy on this one then add up to canva again then just delete this one then paste the new one okay here we go so here is the new one so let's position it to the center okay perfect you can see here this is so amazing and then let's check on the sample one i think we should try to large increase the size of the test and then um, can just import it oh oh it's fine like this i think it's, it's nice like this so this is just the easiest way to uh sorry to design um um this uh instagram of five gig image so i want to try to increase this but since it's not increasing so i just try to position it again to the perfect size so this is just the easiest way to design a five gig image so you can follow this step to design it your own way and i'm very sure you'll be able to come out with something nice at the end so yes after you have finished with your design is done just click on share here so once you click on share you click on the download here so once you click on download so it will you can increase the size you can just download here so it will be downloaded to my pc so i'll try to open it and see how the design looks like so here we go so here is the design sorry here is the design so you can see here this looks amazing this looks amazing and it's of high quality one so this is just the old method you can use to create fiber gig image of your choice and also you can use this method to create a uh, youtube thumbnail as well so this is all I for you if you have any questions you can you drop a comment and i reply to it as soon as possible thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next one peace